All right, let's go ahead and take a look at our weather now. Yes. Jeff, you have been busy yeah, in the very. Weather Center <laughs> because the rest of this week we're going to be expecting on and off rain, right? Yeah, there's so much happening. I really want this uh, first graphic here to be like your at a glance calendar so you can see exactly what's coming our way uh, so you can make plans. Again, just be ready for that rainfall as we move through the next few days. And we're still seeing some breaks in between these storms that should mitigate any kind of widespread flooding. So here's the deal. Next storm system coming as we roll through tomorrow morning. Another Another one on Saturday for Christmas and then late Sunday into Monday morning. We'll see a third system coming back into the bay. So let's get you into Storm Ranger, our mobile Doppler radar, and we do have some areas of drizzle out here tonight. Also, uh, the chance here is some fog visibility is down to a half mile and less. So you want to watch out for that if you're doing traveling tonight, but we're going to hold off for any kind of heavy rainfall really until we hit tomorrow morning. Now it's going to be off to the north here between Guerneville and Fort Bragg by 1030 at night and notice the orange and red within this line of storms. Uh, that's going to be some very heavy downpours. So I think once we hit about four o'clock in the morning, that's going to be over Marin, Napa, Sonoma counties. Winds 20 to 40, isolated thunderstorms, even the chance here is some small hail. So that's really what's different about this from everything else we've really underwent over the past uh, several days. Then it's going to be over the East Bay and Peninsula right at the heart of the commute at seven o'clock in the morning. And then it moves down here to San Jose with heavy, heavy rain. Uh, by 930 and then we'll see this clear on out as we head into the afternoon tomorrow. So rainfall totals with this also focused much different. I think over the Santa Cruz Mountains, we certainly would be in for some of the higher rain totals. The way this is lining up anywhere from one to two inches. San Jose a half to one inch and we'd also be in that half to one inch uh, there through the rest of the Bay Area. So if you're commuting tomorrow, definitely going to be pretty sloppy out there on the roadways. And if you've already started your Christmas vacation, a uh, nice excuse here to just sleep in, maybe catch up on some of those holiday movies and of course NBC Bay Area in the morning. OK, as we bring it into tomorrow morning's forecast, we'll start it off on the chilly side here. Widespread 40s through the Bay Area got you down to 48 in the East Bay, San Francisco 50 and the North Bay 46. Daytime highs as we move into tomorrow remaining cool. No big surprises here. Temperatures in the 50s through the Bay Area. Sierra snow from tomorrow through this weekend going even higher. Check out these numbers. We're looking at 74 inches Kingville, 46 inches South Lake Tahoe, Kirkwood right there at 66. We could see some snow down as low there as Placerville. So on my seven day forecast, you will find that we've got the next system here by Saturday, quarter to three quarters of an inch, then by Monday, a half to one inch, and then next Wednesday, another quarter to half inch. So again, breaks in between these storm systems should help us out. And look at this chill next week. 40s for high Ooh, starting on yikes. Sunday. <laughs> so uh, Jessica and Audrey, those those really cool jackets you all have in the boots and everything. Uh -huh. It's it's like time to get that going, right? It's time. Yeah, yeah. you're still away. Mm -hmm. I'm going to see what Santa brings me. Just oh, I'm waiting. You've been very good. So I'm sure <laughs> lots is coming your way. <laughs> all right. Thank you, Jeff. Yeah.